good morning everyone so in this uh, lecture i'm going to discuss what to do in last 10 days before the before the gate exam now all of we think that before the gate exam someone may be nervous so how the question paper or how the how i am how i will write in the exam right so i am not getting some questions so something like that so don't do or don't think about that so what to do so that first as our uh, what i told in the previous lecture that is so every 3 days revision should be done so so at least before 10 days we may be at least 3 to 4 times our revision is over now paste the formulas and basic concepts on walls in your study room it may be study room it may be in delivering for all subjects remember now it is see some basic concepts or basic formulas in each concept similarly aec signals and systems all the properties of fourier transformer discrete time fourier transform laplace transformer jet transform etc similarly control systems mathematics so integration formulas differential differentiation formulas numerical methods formulas that is bisection method regular falsi method what is the just equations wise then complex variable what is the uh, how to find residue of a of function or uh, how to find integration of a complex function etc similarly network theory what is the resonance condition resonance formulas right and uh, uh transient analysis formulas and uh, um, two port network parameters right etc similarly communication and uh, as well as emtl and basic formulas is required like bandwidth of a analog i mean analog uh, modulation or uh, fmr A- ask fsk digital communication right and uh, how to find channel capacity channel capacity theorem the basic important one similarly emtl what are the maxwell equations right transmission transmission lines and uh, some skin depth formulas right so what is uh, uh, how to find uh, uh, the frequency in a wave guides etc right now after pasting all these things what we need to do before ten days that is day one this is my uh, my conclusions are what i prepared in the previous like uh, gates so from that experience i'm telling if you are panic in last 10 days that means the over uh, that 6 months uh, coaching or whatever we trained that will be gone into waste right so that's why so we have to follow this uh, procedures for to get or to do in well in gate exam <coughs> now see all the formulas and basic concepts of all subjects from morning to evening see so it's not like so basic concepts so in between if you want you can do some problems also in each subject now morning to evening and take one full length test mock test in at the end of the day remember don't sleep in the afternoon not at all so this i will conclude at the Uh, end because why i want don't sleep in the afternoon now after that after that test do the analysis how many marks in each subjects you got or uh, what is the overall performance now before that you may uh, revise one or one subject or something then go to sleep at 10 o'clock only remember this also so we we have to habituate like this all the formulas then or revision of all the subjects in a simple way and one mock test and analysis and don't sleep in the afternoon and then go to the sleep at 10 o'clock right so this is the habituate so we have to do this habit now day 2 is same as above but today after each subject seeing the formulas do the problems in single subject that is it may be network theory it may be adc ac we have to do formulas it may be previous gate problems already you have solved no problem just revise and see without seeing any formula do the problems right then do the analysis suppose if we if we if you are having a mock test on each subject then do that subject test then also again do the analysis how many wrong answers or where you gone wrong etc next similarly don't sleep in the afternoon only sleep at 10 o'clock in the night next the odd days we will do like that only same as day one all the formulas and all the basic concept revision then full length mock test then don't sleep in the afternoon sleep at only 10 o'clock 
day four even day same as day two each subject wise we will do revision or formulas then do the some numericals on the after each subject day five again same as day one right all formulas basic concepts for all subjects then take mock test right once all even days we will do the same as day two that is each subject then problems then um, in the afternoon don't sleep and 10 o'clock similarly day seven as same as day one that is all subjects revision as well as the mock test one next day eight same as day two that is each after each subject will do the for uh, numericals day nine same as day one again so we'll take all formulas and subjects basic concepts are the all subjects and take mock test right now the moment date and before the exam date so we have done so many times of revision so no need of revision take mock test one from 9 to 12 so 9 a.m to 12 a.m so you may sleep at 10 so you may get it at someone will at 5 or 6 or 7 doesn't matter right so 6 is the best I, I think 6 a.m. So before 6 to 9, you may get some you just to see in the walls your basic formulas, etc. Then mock test 1 at 9 to 12. Next, in between, this one is very important. Don't think about the exam, right? Only talk with your close friends or parents, not about the exam in a different matter, right? So don't be in a mood that so how to crack or how to do best in the exam next day so don't do all these things only talk with your parents or friends about your relations or etc etc right then again mock test 2 between 2 to 5 pm then relax and take in talk to your parents not about the exam etc now whenever you are in empty mind thinking about only the gate so you will get different different thoughts like so how will i my my performance or suppose you didn't get some concept in the mock test so you may be thinking that those concepts again so don't think about that just leave how many marks you got just see and seeing only the formulas don't be empty mind in the before exam right so you may get into wrong thinking right so don't be do, do like this only two mock tests you take and between you just relax talk with your parents so again if you are not talking with your someone something so you, your mind will be again thinking in different way about the exam right and don't sleep also so don't sleep in the afternoon or daytime right now so that is about this now again 10 o'clock sleep now here the matter comes suppose someone tries someone has to relax before the exam so they may try at 10 o'clock sleep so suddenly if you change your timings you, you may not get sleep so by thinking about the exam it may extend to 12 in the midnight so what by starting this before 10 days we are habituating by so no sleep at the day and sleep at only night so we will the moment 10 o'clock comes we will we will get sleep by 10 o'clock only at the 10th day right so that is because we are habituated to 10 o'clock then we will maybe wake up at 6 o'clock 10 to 6 that is 8 hours is will be very good sleep then you will be in fresh mind so fully relaxed mind or fresh mind so this fresh mind we need for the to work in the gate exam or to work in the gate exam so so don't now on the day of exam don't see any formulas don't do any mock test or any take, don't take anything so just be relaxed and only take your hall ticket see the exam center and try to go to exam center before maybe one hour that is good before one hour or one and a half hour don't be late or so someone think so maybe half an hour they ask to come so we'll go for half an hour before no go at least one hour or one and a half hour to the exam hall or to the exam center and talk to your friends if you are hanging in don't be empty mind there also right don't think about the exam so the final word is see you cannot change your future but you can change your habits 
and the habits and the habits whatever the habits we or uh, tried the habits will change your future change your future your habits will change your future that's why this 10 days we are trying to habituate 